what's up everybody this is going to be your weekly energy reading so this is for my aries out there whether you're an aries sun moon rising whether you have aries somewhere in your chart or an abundance of aries in your chart you may resonate with this reading my name is chinoa with Waluchai chai readings if you guys would like a personal reading i will leave that information in the description section or the comment um or the i'm sorry the description section or in the caption section if this is posted on Instagram. So if you guys would like a personal reading with me, all the information will be there. And if you guys are a lover of truth, you'll love my channel. If you hate truth and you want everything sugar-coated, you'll hate my channel. Just saying. All right. So anyway, Aries, your overall energy is the Five of Cups. So I'm getting there's a sense of disappointment and... Feeling as though you're torn between staying or leaving a situation, you're not really sure whether or not you should pick up the pieces of something or whether you should let it go. So you're struggling between one energy and another energy, okay? So it seems to be that you're choosing to either see things in a honest light or in an illusionary light it's kind of like do you choose the red pill or the blue pill you know from the matrix it's type it's that type of energy i'm picking up in a situation the prince of cups or the knight of cups he's in reverse his back is turned so i'm getting that spirit may be telling you to turn your back away from something that just isn't moving forward it may have never you know it might be something that's slow moving know the difference between having patience or the difference between wasting your energy on something or someone so it could be a circumstance where you've been very patient um and now it's just it's time to go it's time to move forward with the sun card you need to focus on the positives i feel spirit is saying to focus on the positives of this situation and not waste too much energy on what was or what isn't or what could have been um I do feel like you're not going to get the justice that you deserve or will receive by dwelling in a certain energy and hanging on to something that does not serve you emotionally nor spiritually. It's causing you a lack of peace, I feel. So whatever that is for you, Aries, I do pray and hope and send much love to you that this is a situation you walk away from so that you can have your inner peace back. I do feel like it's up to you what you decide what's best for you and what isn't best for you tarot readings are here just to give you you know shed light on something and give you advice but it's never there to be a concrete decision as far as your life goes it's initially you know or not initially but ultimately it is up to you what decisions you make in life okay so these are just tools to help you navigate through energies but I do hope that this reading resonated with someone. If it does, if you would like a full and in-depth reading, hit me up. If it doesn't resonate, that's too bad. Hopefully the next one will, or maybe I'm just not the reader for you. But much love as always. Take care. Peace.